Hey everyone, this is my first vlog on my moped. I'm just gonna be giving a basic introduction today. And later, I will be installing my new Unipod air filter I got today. But I'm still waiting for my jet kit in the mail. So, really won't be able to ride with it. I'll still take video. Right now it's a chilly 30 degrees out and maybe colder and I think it was just snowing but it's Ohio. I've got a 2005 Tomos 835 Sprint. Got it last June or July for 500 bucks. I think it had 800 miles on it. Now it's almost at 1400 miles. I ride it a lot. Right now it is completely stock. Nothing modified except for my Steelers license plate frame. But later today, like I said, I'm putting on the Unipod air filter and I'll be waiting for the jet kit to properly jet it go over a few things with it. So, it doesn't have oil injection to mix the gas. Um, it's about it's 100 to 125 miles a gallon. On reserve, I'd say it gets about 20 miles on reserve maybe. Uh, it's in it's not in bad shape for its age. Holds up pretty well for what I've done with it. Take it over bumps all the time. Driven it off the curbs. It's held up just fine. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna see what's bad about this one. It's 50 cc, slow right now for a moped. Let's see, something negative about this moped. The high beam doesn't like the work. It never worked when I got it. The chain tensioners, or whatever you want to call it, down there, they're always coming loose and. I've had it come really loose one time. My back wheel was wobbling. It wasn't fun. The brakes easily slip. Well, not the brakes themselves, but the cable slips through the little holder and I have to adjust them quite often. Right now, I have to adjust my front brakes. Because really, they're not much of brakes. Uh, and that's about it for what's bad about it. What do I like about it? Well, it's a moped. It's great on gas. I'm able to drive it in Ohio because I'm 14. You can get a moped permit in Ohio when you're 14. Uh, don't think you have to have insurance. I don't. Um, you don't have. To, I don't have turn signals. You don't have to have those in Ohio. There's, oh yes, one more negative thing. Not much storage room under the seat. I just keep, see. I got some rope. Got some rope down, I got a tool, got my key, pen, I got the manual and some loose change. And that's about all I can hold. Got my lock on the back there. Lock my helmet up to it. Of course, I have the four clock on the front. Can fit a one and uh, one and a half gallon gas tank on the rack. It's useful. You can probably fit a little thing of oil under the seat since they have to mix it. Uh, 